Uh, my name is Amanda Moore, and I'm going to be participating in this year's Grayson County Ag and Arts Adventure. I work with a variety of mediums, but this is some of my work that's acrylic on wood. This is one of my more intricate pieces. Um, it's seven layers of wood. Each layer was cut out individually. Um, I hand stain it. It's been engraved. And then I add some sealant to it. And it is a acoustic guitar. So this is also one of my wood acrylic paintings. Um, it's also been engraved. And I've tried to add the, the Blue Ridge Mountains and a layer of the trees. Um, of course, Appalachian Mountains is, is also engraved on there. I love the culture, I love the history, and especially the river. Um, the river attracts many people. So I've tried to, to pinpoint specific locations such as Elk Creek, Independence, Mount Rogers, of course, is the highest peak in Virginia. I did draw the map. Um, and I added the, the specific places that I wanted and then I engraved it onto the wood. I also add a layer of white paint. The river is actually cut out and then I add a layer of epoxy with blue ink in for the river. So all the work that I do is it's framed and ready to be hung. So whenever you get ready to place it in your home, it's ready to go up on the wall. I also teach at Chestnut Creek School of the Arts where I have multiple classes that you can sign up for. And I'll teach young kids the age of 13 to 17 who are working through some anxieties. So we use an hour and a half to create and, and it kind of helps to calm them down and, and helps them get relaxed. So sharing art is my passion and love. My art can be found year round in the 1908 Courthouse Treasury, a great little gift shop. So I will be exhibiting my artwork during the Ag an art adventure here located in Independence. And I will have a larger display of my work from watercolors to woodworking and lots of acrylics.